The centenary celebration camp of the Nigerian Girls Guard Association is in line with the global celebrations of the organization, marking its achievements and challenges in the last hundred years. Then patient Jonathan, who was recently decorated grand patron of the association, expressed appreciation to the women that have labored over the years to raise distinguished leaders and serve the society. Having received an award for her contribution to well-being of Nigerian women, especially the girl child, the First Lady led dignitaries in presenting awards to other women that have contributed to the growth of the Girls' Guide Association in Nigeria. She said she will create partnership between the association and her NGOs in raising profile of Nigerian women. Let me say again that I am familiar with the spiritual moral and social value that we have historically added to our society. And I enjoy you not to relent. Chief Commissioner of the Girls' Guide Association of Nigeria, Dr. Chris Titobi, said the camp will carry participants through physical and intellectual exercises as well as fashion a way forward for the body. Our parents and guardians find us capable to guide, train, and help their children and what grow up as leaders. An anniversary cake was also cut at the event. Various zones of the Girls' Guide Association made presentations at the ceremony while the First Lady inspected their pavilions. In Abuja, I am Makut Simon Machamp.